welcome to Mama Ruth's house. I'm so glad you stopped in. I have a really cute recipe that is delicious. These are going to be mini stuffed pumpkins. And unfortunately, I couldn't find the orange ones, but it doesn't matter. These will still taste the same. You cut off the top just like you would a jack-o-lantern or anything like that. And we're going to scoop, you scoop out all the, the inside part so it's clean. And then you, um, we're going to saute a cup of bell pepper. I didn't have green, so I'm using red. And a cup of onion in two tablespoons of olive oil. And these are three Weight Watcher points each if you're following the Weight Watcher plan. So I have my oil nice and hot. I'm going to saute these for, you know, just a little bit till everything's soft and um, the onions are translucent. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day as it's getting closer to the holidays. These are going to be so cute. I can't wait and taste so yummy. Very flavorful. It also has quinoa cooked. So I chose to cook mine in um, low sodium chicken broth, but you could cook it in vegetable broth or water. And then this would be a completely vegetarian dish. It smells so good already. I don't know, but three points for one of these. I think that's just fine. I'm going to put you down so you can see a little better. Calls for uh, two large garlic cloves. So I'm going to add those in just a little bit. And then I also did a cup of mushrooms and a cup of chopped fresh tomatoes and a cup of black beans, rinsed and drained. I don't know about you, but onions and bell peppers cooking together just smell so delicious. While these are cooking, I'm going to go ahead and put a little salt and pepper in the bottom of each one of these. I just want them to be seasoned. Let's put a little salt, a little pepper. in the bottom. We're going to add more salt and pepper to our dish anyway, but I just was thinking about it and that's what I would like to do. So I have the oven heated to 375 and these are going to bake for about a half hour in there. Everything in the middle, the, everything in the inside is uh, cooked. So it's basically cooking your, your um, pumpkin. This is also going to have two teaspoons of cumin. I'm going to go ahead and add our garlic. Makes it smell even better. So really, this, this would be zero points if you didn't have the olive oil. Well, and the quinoa, that, that is points as well. It's five points for a cup of quinoa. I'm going to go ahead and add our mushrooms. You don't, you can omit a mushrooms. That is your own choice. 
I really like mushrooms and I had some in there that I needed to use so I just went ahead and chose to put them in here. Let that get cooking. I hope everyone had a lovely day. I've had a beautiful day. I've been cooking today. Um, I'm getting ready to... It's This is Sunday. I know this won't be airing until um, Monday or... I think I might do it Wednesday before Thanksgiving. Um, got to me. Um, this will be airing on... Uh, Tuesday or Wednesday. I think I'm going to air it the day before Thanksgiving instead of on Thursday like I normally do so that it, if you guys chose to make this, then you can make it for Thanksgiving. But anyway, this is Sunday and I'm getting ready. I'm going to go to my daughter's who lives only about 45 minutes away and we're, I'm going to spend the night Tuesday night and Wednesday night so we can prep for Thanksgiving and then my husband will be coming on Thanksgiving and we'll be enjoying our day together with all of our family. Well, we're going to be missing two, but they uh, have another prior commitment for actual Thanksgiving Day, but we'll get them next year. It's okay. Got to do what you got to do when you have um, blended families. Not a big deal. And they're going to be with us on Christmas, so that'll be nice. All right, I'm going to go ahead and add our fresh chopped tomatoes. Just getting that heated through. I think at this point I'm going to go ahead and add salt and pepper to taste. I'll probably be sneezing because this pepper always makes me sneeze. To add our black beans. Our cumin. It smells so good. And our cooked quinoa. Oh, that looks amazing. So if you haven't cooked with quinoa, it is a type of grain, and um, it's very good for you. It's, it's delicious. It fills you up. All right. Now we're ready to stuff our pumpkins. I don't think, I don't know, that spoon's going to be a little tricky, I think. Well, maybe. I'll go back through with another spoon and kind of squish it in there.
Now I'm going to take a smaller spoon and go back through and kind of squish them in there just a little bit. Now we're going to put the tops back on. and bake it like that. All right. I'm going to wipe off any outside juice. I know it'll come out anyway, but just to start it off, we'll kind of. All right. Those are super cute. Okay, we're gonna put them in the oven and let them bake. And we'll be back in about a half hour and see how they are. I got them out of the oven. They were in there about a half hour. I'm going to put a little bit of cheese and put them back in for just a few minutes till it melts. And then we'll take them out and try it. I'm going to put the uh, mild cheddar fat-free cheese on top. I'm not going to put it back in there with the, the lids. They kind of got done already. So we're going to put it back in like this and it won't take too long at all. And then we'll be back. They came out so cute and they got a little bit uh, browned and the cheese is melted. I just put the little hats back on there and uh, we'll taste one. They look wonderful. I don't know which one. I guess it don't matter. It's super hot. Put a little bit of parsley on there just to make it for color. It's so cute. Let me bring you up so we can it's super hot, so I'll have to I'll have to be careful. I love pumpkin, so I'm going to have some of the pumpkin as well. I hope everyone enjoys this and um, this recipe. And as much as I loved making it, it's so cute. I wanted to let everybody know that I will be on Good Day 
for my halfway point of my weight loss journey, showing people what, what you can do with leftover turkey with my little turkey roll-ups. Um, and that will be Sunday the 26th of November. So I will be on Good Date and be sure to tune in. Mmm, super flavorful. And this is only three points. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, this is, I, this is good. I'm going to have another bite. This is a two bite tester. But it's super hot. I want to thank everybody again for um, supporting me and watching my channel. Please subscribe and share and hit that bell to get notifications on when new videos come out. It's really appreciated. It really helps my channel. Thank you so much. Until next time, make a fantastic day. Bye.